Okay, so I'm going to be doing um, active range of motion with the goniometer, lining this up. I'm going to have you do dorsiflexion first, so bring your toes towards you. Keep that here. Okay, so active range of motion for dorsiflexion is 20 degrees. Now point your toes down like you're stepping on a gas pedal. So that's at 50 degrees. Um, next, I'm going to do passive range of motion for dorsiflexion too. So I'm going to have you scoot to the edge of the table. I'm going to hold here and force her into dorsiflexion. So that's for dorsiflexion too. And again, this will be compared bilaterally. Um, next, I'm going to do um, manual muscle testing. So I'm going to have you scoot back again. So I'm going to have her do ankle dorsiflexion, so bring your toes towards you. I'm going to apply pressure. Okay. And then I'm going to have her go down for plantar flexion as I apply pressure. Okay. I'm going to have you point your toes in for inversion, and then point your toes out for eversion, good. So that was manual muscle testing, and again this will be compared bilaterally. So now I'm going to do some special tests. I'm going to start with um, POTS compression tests. So Scoot towards the edge of the table. And I'm going to squeeze here. And if she has pain going down the tibial shaft or the fibular shaft, that would be a gross fracture. Um, otherwise, it would be a syndesmosis sprain. If it was um, just pain. Um, in one spot, or at the tibiofibular joint. It would be um, a syndesmosis sprain. And then I'm going to do, so that was POTS compression test, and now I'm going to do home and sign. So I'm going to have you scoot back. I'm going to lift here and force her into dorsiflexion. And if she has pain in her calf, that would indicate that um, she has deep vein thrombosis. <clears throat> okay, so now I'm gonna do myotome testing. So for L4, it's ankle dorsiflexion. So put your foot into dorsiflexion and don't let me um, pull you back, okay? So hold there, good. So that's myotome testing for L4. And then for L5, um, I'm gonna have her do great toe extension. So you're gonna extend your big toe and don't let me break you, okay? So I'm gonna stabilize here, good. And then um, for S1, I'm gonna have her do ankle plantar flexion. Don't let me break you. Good. And then for this last one, I'm going to have her do knee flexion. So um, actually, I'm going to have you flip over. Can you hold it behind you? Yeah. Ugh. I need you laying down, though. You need laying down, though. Yeah. Here, Kate, lay down. <laughs> I'll just support it with my water bottle. Okay. So I'm going to have you flex your knee. 
and I'm going to pull you this way, and don't let me break you, okay? Ready? Go. Got to stabilize here. Good. And that's it for my tongue testing.